Hey guys, we're off to the Cobb Valley this afternoon. Um, it's just gone one o'clock. Has it just gone twelve o'clock? Not sure if the clocks went back this morning. <laughs> I think it's twelve o'clock. Um, it's up in the Kang Karangi National Park. Valley Road and we've got to the Cobb River Valley Power Station and it's really cool because it drops the water all the way down the hill down this pipe into the power station turn to turn the big turbines and then pumps it out of the side of the building so can you see it that's the large pipe up there that the water zooms down into the building to, to turn the wheels So from the power station onwards the road is gravel and um, because we had a big rain like a week ago or so and then it rained again a couple of days ago, um, the road is pretty rough. Probably wouldn't recommend it in a large camper van, you wouldn't want to do it in a large camper van. You'd probably do it in a small camper van but just be wary if there's like been a big rain or like flooding just before you go then the track might be a bit hard to navigate. We've made our way up to the top and this is the reservoir. What's the reservoir called Ben? Cobb Valley Reservoir. Yeah. Beautiful. It's a bit chilly. And we just got to the top of the hill and um, coolant started leaking out of our car. It's obviously got a bit hot and we're just hoping it's the overflow and there's still some left in there so um just hope we can get back home <laughs> yeah, it's beautiful it's pretty spectacular don't you think there's um you can there's loads of tramping tracks and there's one just on the hill to the right of the picture now you can't see it's too far away but there's one up there and there's a little information hut over here Some information about the building of the dam and things this is some information about um, walks you can go on from here on a little map just walked around the side of the information hut I don't think we're gonna go in because the number of bumblebees just mm. sat on the windowsill and buzzing around there's loads there's loads over there too and there's loads here. Ben just stood there, so I'm going to walk my way down this gravelly path and hopefully not slip over. Damage both cameras and my legs. The wind's blowing quite a bit. I don't know if you'll be able to hear it on the camera, but it's, ooh, it's cold. <laughs> Bumblebee graveyard in that little hut. Someone's actually written that in the book and said they either need to put like a net on the door so they can't get in or build an opening window in the hut so they can get out because at the moment they can't figure out how to get out of the door and there's just loads they've just flown in and then they're dying in here basically. conservation rangers has obviously just had a sweep up because outside there's just hundreds of little bumblebees dead on the floor which is a bit of a shame really isn't it 